Yeah, and it's, I think, maybe a good time to to say, like, it's helpful to, like, re- reorient your mind just toward, away from, like, justice, equality, and all right. these things, and toward right. just freedom. freedom. Yeah, freedom. Just, like, just face value, just yeah. freedom. Because they're, yeah. right. they're not the same thing. Yeah. They're not the same thing. This is relevant. I, yeah. Thank you for bringing this up. It's <clears> yeah. relevant, literally, to the top of the discussion exactly the KRS one thing like it doesn't have to be this this like tug of war of like who gets to be on top you know and yeah it happens with white supremacy but you also see it happening with patriarchy where you got the whole girl boss dynamic where a lot of people's idea of feminism is just subverting the same dynamic and having women on top and that's not you know it might be fun for a little bit for you i don't know but like it's not going to solve anything in the long run, right. and the same is true for uh, uh, for white supremacy. You know, mm-hmm. like I don't know. I wrote a joke that I don't know if it, uh, if I'll ever use it, but just like I think it would be real funny to just walk on walk up on stage and be like, "Hey, you ever you ever notice how they?" Uh, it's fuck capitalism now that black people got a piece, and then wait for people to do applaud and be like that is a stupid thing to say what I just said, <laughs> you know? <laughs> it's just like, it's fun to play with people's <laughs> expectations, you know? But like, but yeah, just so many people fall into that trap of just, I mean, we already said it, we're just like trying to get what white people have rather than trying to get what we want, mm-hmm. you know? Can I speak to the justice thing on that point? Yeah. Because I, I would define just, people conflate justice and freedom. To me, justice is, that's just the administration of some sort of law or yeah. authority. And under capitalism in the state, it's clear who who is administrating that. Yeah. Right? So it's like, it doesn't actually, it also doesn't, it's kind of like, it's, it's speaking after the fact. There's nothing like preventative. It's just yeah. like, some people can, you can interpret it and twist it to mean like, oh, real justice would be these crimes never occurring but in in co- a concrete sense when we're talking about justice we're talking about like righting a wrong right? right and i feel like in the context of north america going back to the judeo christian roots thing there is also this like it's the administration of law and authority intertwined with sh- a shame and guilt right yeah. thing too so it's not just like it's not which sure whatever like some some people might think like that's that's cool but for me it distracts from it's just a there's a catharsis in it especially yeah. living under under the the systems that we're in but it it distracts from what would be a solution in a truly communal and democratic context right, right. which would be healing for everyone that's actually yeah. what would what would lead to the solution solving and preventing what happened to begin with right for a for a concrete example um, for anybody who's still not clear, justice would be maybe just imagine every time a black person gets shot by the police, we protest for a little bit and then they get a, say a $3 million payout to the family. And then you ask yourself every time, huh, I guess I'm, I guess I'm not out in the streets anymore, but it still doesn't feel right. And now we just put a price on this person's head. Let's go even. So, yeah. I mean, and so you st- it gets to a point where like if you follow to that that to its logical conclusion why didn't we just why didn't we just go to the family and offer them 3 million dollars to kill that person you know it's is it not the same thing are you not just buying a person's life you know it it yeah, it amounts it amounts to uh it amounts to putting a price on people's lives on people's bodies on people's uh on people's freedom on just piecemeal you know it's quantifying it's quantifying humanity in a way that I don't think people really have a grasp of when they go out in the streets and ask for justice or 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 equality, you know? Like equal to what? What are you talking about? The you money know? the money point is super relevant on the private, you know, prison industry, yeah. on what conversations around the death penalty. They're like, "Oh, you know, that's they're it's taking from our tax dollars to yeah. keep them from sitting there rotten in jail. Exactly. We got to take them out." I mean, bro, there was a there was a clip I think I mentioned after uh after the Tyree Nichols incident. There was a clip of a cop talking about 
what's more expensive? Is it is it more expensive to right. kill a man or to right. injure him and have to take care of him for the rest of his life? Right. You know? Right. So why not just kill him if you can just give a quick $3 million payout to the family as opposed to $3 million a year for the rest of his life? You know? But that's justice. And I was that is, and it, I'm gonna and I'm gonna say that's I think that's brilliant through the the monetary lens, the financial lens. Let's let's go to a dark ages hypothetical here. Let's <laughs> yeah, say a yeah. cop, a cop, you know, every time a cop kills a you know a black person, they get to kill the cop. We we go eye for an eye. Every time they yeah. kill somebody, we get to kill a cop or whatever, or they they get put on death row. However you wanna you wanna frame it. It's the same. It's the same yeah. function. The same function is happening. Nothing right. actually interrogates the systems that allowed the cop to kill this unarmed black person. Right. Yeah. What was that? Um, the shit from from debt from Graver, where he was talking about how like <laughs> he was talking about how they were trying to they were trying so hard to quantify how much it would cost to like. Mm -hmm if you accidentally killed somebody's bee or some dumb <laughs> shit <Yeah>. like that. <laughs> that's what the system does. Like, that's yeah. what it does. That's what it the system does. literally quantifies that's every quantify possible, everything. every single human action, you know, yeah. to try to reach some it type of- tax everything. Yeah, it tax every single thing. Taxes. Quantify every <laughs> action and try to reach complete parity in a system that we can't even comprehend. <laughs> Right, you know, we can't grasp right. all of the potential <laughs> things that could happen, but we're trying to put price tags on all. We of don't them. even That's know what, what value is yet. Right, we don't know what the <laughs> fuck that is. What that means. We don't even know what knowledge is. <laughs> right, knowledge. <laughs> knowledge. My Lamborghini here. Right, <laughs> right. Hollywood my Hills. Lamborghini. Yeah, look at all these books. All right, <laughs> <laughs> knowledge. Knowledge. You know, it's, you know it's better than than you know, my Lamborghini. Lam Lamborghini. Nah, no, I I love Ty Lopez. <laughs> I love that guy. 